Changes may soon be coming to the Birmingham Water Works Board. A new bill that would dramatically overhaul the current board passed the House Committee today 6 to 5. Our Lauren Jackson in Montgomery for the hearing and tonight on what changes could be coming. It was a packed room here at the State House in Montgomery as House Committee members voted on a new bill that would fire all of the nine current Birmingham Waterworks board members and replace them with seven new people. The bill still needs to go through the full house, but lawmakers are split on what to do. Birmingham Waterworks has the worst customer satisfaction in the southeast. Reading Waterworks complaints to the crowd, Representative Jim Carn says something needs to be done to the current Birmingham Waterworks board to improve things like billing and meter reading. This has been an ongoing problem, as you know, for probably three or four years. So uh, for people to say this was an ambush is kind of a stretch. Carnes is pushing a new bill that changes the number of board members, who can appoint them, and what qualifications they must have. They may or may not be reappointed because they may not have the qualifications. In the new bill, Birmingham's mayor and city council would each get two appointments, one each for Blunt and Shelby counties, and one appointment for the Jefferson County Mayor's Association. But Birmingham Waterworks Chairman Teresia Huffman says they're already representing those customers and making new changes to their board policies. Right now, this board is a regional board. We have the mayor, we have Birmingham, we have Shelby County, we have the Mayor's Association, we have Blunt County. We have issued an RFP for automatic media reading. We're going to have a project management consultant come in, look at our system, tell us what's the best AMI way to do things. We're going to keep looking at billing issues and seeing what can we do better. Huffman and five others spoke to representatives. We have focused on our maintenance program and replacing aging pipes. Asking for more time to fix the board's problems before members are replaced. Give us the time to do those things. I've been chairwoman four months, and in my four months, you know, I'm fighting this bill as well as making sure that we are coming up with better policies for our board. Passing the House committee by just one vote, the future of Birmingham Waterworks Board is still up for debate. This is uh, kind of a hot issue, so we'll see where it goes. The bill has now been released by the committee and will head to the full House for a vote. If it passes majority, it will then head to the Senate. But Representative Carnes tells me he does not know know when this next vote will be in Montgomery. I'm Lauren Jackson, WBRC Fox 6 News on your side.